Okay, this is Air Gunner's Edge. Uh, my Dreamline 22 cal. Uh, this is going to be the spacer that I have on the spring. Right now, I just checked. I have 215 thousandths, 215.5. From the end to the end cap so we're just going to pull this out just so i also remember every gun is going to be different yours may vary and i should have had this ready but okay and uh lead slinger actually posted that you can do this uh, without using a spacer against the uh, spring um, I haven't seen that video yet so I can't comment on that which would be great but for right this second uh, these are two spacers that I have in here now I believe one might have been stock, I can't quite remember, but I'm just going to give a quick, quick uh, overall measurement. It's 100,000, 130,000, and the OD will be. Uh, just about 380, uh, 300 and 378,000 and for ID, oops, sorry, 215,000 for the ID, oops, sorry. Out of focus. My apologies. The ID is 215 thousandths. <clears throat> now, if someone wanted a stiffer spring, which honestly I haven't even measured this yet, so. Two inch, 220 thousandth. This might save some people some time. 270 thousandths for the ID of the spring. And the wire diameter. Just trying to keep it in focus here. I'm trying to do two things at once. Watch it and see if it's in focus. And so the wire diameter is about. 55 thousandths. Okay, so this is for the Dreamline. This is uh, 22 cal. This is uh, the dimensions for the spring. So if you guys want to look around, I can't say that an impact or crown or any other FX will work. You'd have to see if you can get measurements. But uh, here you go for uh, the dimensions there. And this is the end cap, <clears throat> and these fit uh, just under, come on, sorry, I just got out of work, I got dirty hands. Uh, but as you can see, they just go below so that spring can sit on there. If you're above, uh, that spring is going to ride around and you'll have issues. I found that out when I first tried to do this. So I just found two shims. I think these were from a carburetor rebuild kit, Holly. Um, I have tons and tons of spacers and everything. Anything I think I can use for an air rifle, I collect. I always find use for it later on. Okay, so I hope that helps anyone out. And uh, good shooting to anyone who's got the weather.